Greetings everyone, welcome back to Danganronpa 2 Goodbye Despair. It's been a while since I've last played the game, so let's click load and we left off here. Yes, it's been a while since I've, since I've played this game. I forgot what was happening, you know? Um, oh yeah, we were here. Now, what do we do? <laughs> what do we do? Uh, go that way? Short, no, okay, uh, okay. I use this. So do I talk to everyone? Let's talk to Akame. I forgot what voice I gave everyone. I know Gundam's voice, because that's just the voice I do. Okay. I got a new microphone, and last time I played Danganronpa, I didn't have the microphone. So let's, let's do this, okay? You don't have to pay attention to me. Just go. I'll catch up with you soon. Uh, you don't seem so persuasive. Oh, what the heck? Why is it on auto? How do I turn off auto? Oh, it's space parking. I can't help it. When I get hung... When I get... When I get hungry, I lose most of my energy. I hate that spacebar is auto. After she said that, Akane ate the entire pile of food on her plate in one gulp. Scarf blah 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 blah. Yada. I don't... So annoying. Uh, yeah. Talk fast. Okay. Yeah. Let me make sure my ass... Move. Okay, yeah. It's the right size. I'm just making sure on OBS it was the right size. Let's talk to Gundam Tanaka. Go, jump I'm kinda sick right now. I'm kind of sick right now. Like I mentioned in the in the Honkai Star Rail video. But either way, <clears throat> my four dark divas of destruction, let us venture to the end of the earth, Jabberwock Park. There is no need to shout. Just hurry up and go already. Okay. So we are going to the park, right? That's where that's where we gotta go. Okay. Uh. I, I'm hoping to finish this game in this, like, you know, less videos than I did with Danganronpa. Just because the first two videos, of course, they were short. Because I was playing on an uh, old iPhone and kept crashing. But either way. Do not tell me you do. Me too? What are you talking about? Uh, oh, Miss Mahiro has asked me to take a leadership position. Well, Byakuya is being too forceful about leading us. Doesn't that raise a red flag? Hey, hey! Please, Sonia, think about it again. J don't you think you should be the leader instead? Uh, I am certain that I am ill-suited to be one. I... Furthermore, though Byakuya may be forceful, I believe he has the qualities to be an effective leader. Huh? Eh? Really? Please listen! Do you not remember what he said about being de destined to stand above all others? He is truly attempting to fulfill that destiny by the strength of his own will. His impressive... A stature and physique is a testament to his desire to be the ultimate affluent pro progeny, no? Uh, that is truly grand. I guess that's one way of looking at it. Hmm. When you put it like that, Sonia, it does sound convincing. Hey, hey! Okay, I understand. I'm sorry for being so pushy, Sonia. No, it, simp it is simply, simply matter a matter of, matter of regal discretion. Okay. We gotta click R to exit. Goddamn. <laughs> we gotta go outside. Let's head to the park. Because I believe that's where it's So I better hurry up and follow after Ryakia. Uh, he's at Jabberwock Park, I believe. Okay. Ooh, I, I, I still hate the fact that it's zoomed in like this. I don't even... I, I don't think... Damn it. What's, what's the pause button? What the fuck is the pause button? Tab. And the tabs open the map. What the pause button? Seriously, what the fuck is the pause button? Did they make the pause button so hard? To find. I have no idea which one it is. I mean, what are you doing? You should hurry over to the park. Ah! <laughs> Didn't this same thing happen last time too? Hey! Hajime, how many times are you gonna surprise me? I just spoke to you normally. Anyway, you should hurry over to the park. Damn it. Shut up. I'm going back to my room. Seriously. This is all just one big asshole. Ah! Alright, damn it. Seriously. If we're on a tropical paradise, then why are we in this situation in the first place? Uh, isn't that right? Isn't the vacation supposed to be nothing but lounging around and sipping on coconut juice? Relax. Snapping at me won't change a thing. Hey! Hajime, it's decided. You better come to the beach with me later. Or uh. coconuts, damn it! I saw some big ones that fell onto the shore. I haven't figured out how to split them open, but once I do, we're gonna have ourselves some coconut juice. You can't just will a coconut open. Just give up and and get some coconut juice from the supermarket. You don't understand. Fine. Um, be the way. Be that way. I'm never gonna ask for your help again. 
he left. I hope I hope he goes straight to the park. Now then, I should hurry too. I don't really like coconut milk. Well, I do. Coconut milk is my favorite. Actually, I, I don't know what I'm saying. Coconut milk is my favorite um type of milk. Cause I do not like milk, but coconut milk just tastes good. Um, but I don't like it when it has the coconut little flakes inside of it. I hate those. Those make it taste worse. The so coconut milk without the flakes just tastes good. <laughs> but either way, let's head over to the park. I don't remember where the park is. I don't know. Is it over there? I think it might be over here. Across this bridge. The central island. Yeah, okay. It should be on the central island. That's the only thing on the central island? I don't remember. <laughs> well, the central island just has all of the... All of the bridges that leads to all the other islands with the, the mono beast blocking them, okay? God, I need a sneeze, but I... Ah, it just doesn't... Oh, there it is. Grab a apart. Okay. Let's head on in. Jabberwock Park. Everyone's here, okay? <laughs> For skinny people, you, you're awfully slow. Um, it seems you're just too fast for us. Jeez, I never expected a fat so like him to move so fast. So, what, um, what's supposed to be here? What? Here? Really? Such ignorance. <laughs> we haven't noticed it yet. And I was right to dismiss you all as idiots. That in the back. This. <laughs> what, what is that? Goddamn. Okay. That's about a... I say that as a thumbnail, but wait, whatever. I was about to turn off my webcam just so I can. An, ob an obviously out of place object placed in the center of a peaceful park. It looks like a clock, but something seems off. It's counting down? Well, it's not really counting down. What's it's just going on? What's this here? Uh, was this here when we came last time? No. No, I'm pretty sure it wasn't. I found it this morning when I was exploring the island one more time. It's unknown when it was actually placed here. It appears. Monokuma must have placed this object. What does this count on even or what does this count on even mean? I have no clue! <laughs> or once again, something has appeared that I don't understand. But it's got nothing to do with me because I refuse to believe this is happening. Hold on! Could it be? It better not be a bomb! Are you kidding me? A b b b b bomb Not possible. If they wanted to blow up the island, they would have done so by now. There's no need for a countdown. No, not, not really. <laughs> then, what are they counting down? It's a mystery. Right? A mysterious mystery, isn't it? <gasps> Hanami? What? W why are you here? Um... I heard everyone talking while I was patrolling, so I came over. Uh... No, not that. I... Didn't Monokuma kill you? I see. Ah, uh, so that's why you were surprised. You don't have to worry about that. After all, I can never die. It appears I you see. It must be an undead abomination risen from the foulest depths of the netherworld by black magic. Do you want me to make you my thrall? Hey. Monami. Monami's a mechanical stuffed animal, right? Doesn't that mean she can't die in the first place? <laughs> now that you mention it, sh uh, she'd only need like a sp or something. A spare? What a mean thing to say. <laughs> However, you have arrived at the perfect time. There's something I want to ask you. Come on. What is the meaning of this? What, what's the meaning behind this timer and, and this countdown? Answer me. Huh? What is this? I'm sorry. I don't know what this is. You really don't know? I I'm sorry. I don't really have a grasp on what Monokuma's up to. Huh? You don't know? Even though you're Monokuma's little sister? That's I'm not my brother's little sister. Did she accept the role or not? Which one is it? <laughs> anyway, let's all do our best. Let's kick the evil Monokuma off this island. If you don't know what the countdown is for, you're useless to us. Get lost. Um, um let's together i, I said get, oh, okay yeah. i'm sorry um um perhaps you were being a little too harsh i'm starting to feel sorry for it ah. miss sonia may i call you miss sonia no i insist on calling you that i won't be fooled there's no need to feel sorry for that thing she's obviously working with monokuma hey bastard who the fuck cares about that stuffed animal more importantly what the hell is that clock hmm. looks ominous doesn't it 
Who put that object here, and how did they do it in, s in, in just one night? I can't imagine. Which means it doesn't make any sense. Also, it's deadly. <sighs> well, could have carried it with the Mono Beast, you know? Could have had it somewhere and just put it there. No, it's not that hard. It's not that hard to do it all in one night. However, that's not all that's unimaginable. This island is, the f is full of mysteries that we can't begin to imagine. For example, how were the 16 of us brought to this island? Hmm... I wasn't trying to think about that since it's, since it's been bugging me too, but he's right. That is a mystery. There's more. Why is Jabberwock Island, which was known for being a popular resort destination, now an uninhabited island? There is no sign of tourists or even citizens on this island. Is something like that even possible? This too must be the will of causality. All civilizations are destined to collapse, and existence begets nothing. So it collapse? You are right. Society is much it's much like fruit. Once it matures, un ine is in inevitable that it will eventually rot. As the economy grows, the private sector stagnates as elders and bu bureaucrats become more and more powerful. As time passes, this power becomes the status quo and crushes the seeds of any possibility or a, a possible reformance. Reformation. Okay, whatever. Such a sad trend. I don't really understand all that, but I feel like the situation here is somewhat different. Maybe the Monobies killed everyone on this island, and that's how it became uninhabited. It's certainly possible. That's a possibility, but we don't know that for sure. Hmm. This mystery remains a mystery, it seems. It's like everything here is just full of mis- God, I cannot read. It's everything here is just full of mysteries. Hmm. You're right. It's mysteries on top of mysteries. However, since these mysteries are overlapping with one another, I doubt some known name group is behind this. What are you trying to say? So in other words- I This situation where in- is undeniably the work of some enormous organization. An enormous organization? Hmm. Monokuma, the Monobeasts, they're all machines that require major technical skill to operate. Are we screwed? Plus, they need a ton of funding. There's no way those things were made just for the hell of it. In other words, that organization might be controlling these machines and monitoring, monitoring the island with those cameras. Could those fiends be hiding on this island? Not possible. Not likely. They're probably running this from somewhere else, somewhere safe. Oh? Where would that be? I don't know. Anyway, there's no mistake that an enormous organization is behind all this. I see, a big organization, huh? I can't imagine what kind of people they <laughs> they could be. In other words, well, let's see. There's my Togami Corporation, Sonia's Novosela Kingdom, and the Kazuria Kazuria Clan. It would definitely have to be an organization as powerful as one of those groups. If not more so. Huh? huh? I'm used to being mistrusted. Do what, uh, do what you will. Hey! Hold on, I don't care about you or the Kazuria clan, but I won't allow you to doubt Miss Sonia. Miss Sonia is a hot blonde princess. Little sharp dis <laughs> distinction be between her and you punks. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, just shut up already, loser. Whoa! L loser? Are you talking about me? It's obvious from your flashy clothes that you just want to stand out because you're actually a loser. <laughs> uh, must be hard to make your living in, in the lame-ass loser industry. <laughs> too far, dude. That's good. That's going way too far. Hey, Biakia, were you serious just now about this being related to your family and Sonia's and such? <laughs> I'm just using them as an example. I'm not saying they have anything to do with this. But you're certain that we're up against a huge organization, right? However... Even if such an organization exists, why would they make us go through something like this? Whatever! H how long are we gonna keep talking about this? Wh why don't we talk about something more realistic? Our enemy's purpose is still unknown. 
As long as we find out who's behind this, we'll learn their purpose. So, in other words... So, what we must do now is find out who our enemy is. If we do that, we'll be that... Excuse me. Uh, we'll be that much closer to a breakthrough. Luckily, according to the e-handbook, we are free to explore this island. There will definitely be a clue about the enemies on this island somewhere. Let's start looking. Alright, let's get this crap done. What are we looking for? Hey. Akane, are you even listening? We need to find clues that will help well, that will tell us our enemy who our enemy is. Fine. No problem. No matter how large this organization may be, they will not be able to stand against us. <laughs> They're destined to fall and turn to ash at the might of my four dark divas of destruction. Wow! Wow! Hamsters came out Hamsters came out of your scarf. They are so adorable. What? Adorable, you say? Thank you. <laughs> oh my my! You're pretty happy about that, huh? Look at that. Look at that. Look at that guy talking to Miss Sonia all casually. I'm definitely gonna beat the crap out of him later. I don't get it. In this tense situation, we all need to be a lot more cautious. And yet, I'm relieved everyone is in such high spirits. It's strange, but I feel like I can rely on them. This must be what it means to have the confidence of an ultimate. Then, what am I? Am I confident enough to call myself one of them? I don't know. <laughs> Damn it, I still can't remember. What talent am I supposed to have? Listen. Anyway, let me just say this. There's no time to think about something as foolish as killing each other. You must do what you have to do. Observe, speculate, recognize, comprehend. Even if it seems impossible, just pers persevere. But most importantly, follow my lead. I'll make sure to return you all to your normal lives. This is your, this leader's, is your leader's order. Understand? That's like, totally awesome. That's right. That right hand of his is so plump. I've got the perfect nickname for him. Ham hands. You say? <laughs> Hmm. Interesting. I never thought I'd see the day where someone called me something like that. Why aren't you getting mad? Naturally. Why wouldn't I get mad at something as petty as that? She observed me directly and thought up a nickname. There's nothing dishonest about a name like that. <laughs> Perhaps I've always yearned for this. Though I may seem ironic, it may seem ironic for me to realize that in this particular situation, He's totally monologuing right now. Such silly talk. Don't worry about it. I was talking to myself just now. I, I see. I don't really get it, but I guess this guy isn't isn't just some overconfident narcissistic jerk after all. Despite our situation, he's mysteriously calm. He might just be a reliable person after all. All right. I completely forgot about Nagito. <clears throat> all right then. We should listen to Byakuya and not waste our energy thinking about pointless things. It's true that- I just had a voice crack. It's true that we're not in the best situation, but, but it's also not the worst. Great! Because we're not alone. We have friends we can count on to support each other. Well- Seriously? That sounds so lame. I- I knew it. I was- I was thinking to myself just- just- I was thinking to myself just how lame I sounded for saying that. Friends, huh? Until now, I never really thought about it. Friendship? That sort of thing seems embarrassing. I never would have thought about it in this situation. No, actually, it's more like because of this situation. In the end, we never solved the mystery of the ominous countdown. But without losing heart, we all went back to the hotel. Believe in your friends. Huh? It'd be difficult to believe in them right now, but it'd be nice if it could happen a, li uh, a little at a time. If I'm starting to think like that, doesn't that sh doesn't that show I'm making good progress? I don't know. Maybe <laughs> I only found one of the Monokuma guys. Now then, uh, there's no reason to hole up in my room and stare blankly into space. Uh, since there's time, it'd be a great idea if I went ahead and talked to everyone. Yeah, I know it's sudden, but it's time for a brief tutorial. During the school trip, there will be moments called free time. During free time, you'll be able to strengthen friendships by spending time with the other students. Also, if you give them a present afterwards, you might make an even a better impression. 
you can obtain presents from the mon mono uh, y uh, y yashin what? and the vending machine at the supermarket. When you strengthen a friendship, an, an intimate event is activated and added to the report card. Also, if you show any hope fragments you've gathered to Usami via the report card, you can gain new skills. Feel free to strengthen your friendship with uh, as many uh, people as you want. Also, when you spend time with someone, time will pass, and you will return to your cottage afterwards. After passing the time several times, your free time will end, and you will continue on the main story. By the way, you can skip free time by resting in your cottage bed, although I don't really recommend it. Please use it if you want to just continue the main story right away. Free time! I'm going to go talk to you. How do I open up my damn freaking... Um... Oh, there's that. Uh, it's X. Why is it X? Okay. Let me go to system. Uh, go to options. Can I change my FOV? No, there's no FOV option here. Okay. I see how it is. But I gotta go to my uh, presence. Oh shoot, I didn't start. I gotta go to presence. Hey, do I just click it? There we go. If I don't have anything, then I'm gonna have to go get something. Because I want to... Uh, I have nothing. <laughs> or actually, I have one. I have one. All the way down here. I have a broken wand. That's it. A broken wand. What am I going to do with a broken wand? Because I want to uh, go talk to Hyoko. So let me just leave real quick and go find the mono Yashin or whatever you call it. Where do I find it though? I don't know where to find the mono Yashin. Hyoko's uh, right there. So you better stay there. Stay there. <laughs> um. Can I find the Mono Yashin in the hotel? I'll go look. I'll go look. Because I want to find it. I don't see it. Um, yeah, I don't see it here. This is, uh, arcade machines. Uh, yeah, nothing here. There's the reception desk. I would like to go outside. Okay. Yeah, I need to sneeze, but I just can't. Where do I find the Mono Yashin? Let me look at the map. What was it? Uh, it was tab, right? That just shows me this. Um, okay. I'm gonna go X. And look at the map. Okay. Um, so that area. This is the hotel. What is this? Those are just, uh, places I can teleport to. Okay. How do I go to the next, um, how do I go to the next area? I don't know. Plus, Yoko's there. Can I just leave? How do I leave? I don't know. How do I... Can I not leave a map for anywhere else? Oh, there we go. Okay. The ranch, the airport, the market. I'll go to the market. Go here. Okay. Let's go inside the rocket punch market. I might be able to find the mono machine here, but I don't know. I know I can get the vending machine here. Let's go to the vending machine. Yes, I would like to purchase something from the vending machine. Let's try purchasing something. Yeah. What do I want to buy? Do I have any? I have 10. I have 10 mono coins. What would Hiyoko like? Would she like a, a baguette? <laughs> Potato chips? Jewelry? I don't think she's the jewelry type of person. Ghost stones? Toy camera? Rep uh, replicant sword? Yo, it's the sword from the first game. Fan's nut? What? Fan's <laughs> nut? It's 50. These are expensive. Holy Jesus. But man's nut. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I don't know what she would like. Uh... I don't know if she would like the tissues, the dolls, the ramune. Chocolate? Chip? Jerky. That's jerky. That seems gross. I don't know. Uh, cod row baguette. I'll get the baguette and the ramune. Okay. And then just because... Uh, I'll get the dolls. Okay. Let's go talk to... Oh, found one. So this is uh, just one of those guys right there. I gotta move this way. He's right there. Yo, what's poppin'? Huh? I got a Are hidden you mono. Serious? Boom. There's nothing else here, so let me open up the map again. Um, and go to Hyoko, which Hyoko's all the way over here. And uh, teleport to uh, there. Okay. Hyoko, 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 what's poppin', Hyoko? That's weird. Wow, a stranger is talking to me. I don't know anyone who would try to talk to me so casually. What should I do? Should I hang out with Yoko? Invite Hyoko, Hyoko to hang out. Yep. What? You don't speak English or something? You're so annoying. Despite Hyoko's uh, constant bad mouthing, I continue to stay by her side. It looks like Yoko and I grew a little closer, or did we? 
Uh, would you like to? Definitely. I don't know what I would give her. Um, I won't give her the, the baguette. Okay, she likes it. Hey, hey. This looks boring and shady, and it doesn't suit me at all. But I guess I'll act happy for now. Hey, hey. hey Hajime. I've been thinking this ever since I first met you. But will you get mad if I say it? I'm not going to get mad every time you say something to me. I see. Then I'm going to say it. Um, um, um I've been thinking that ever since I first met you, <sighs> you have a shady looking face. And you look like the kind of person who's too lazy to try hard. And not only that, I think you're so hopeless for coming after me like some pedo pervert. Uh, hold on. If you think I have a shady looking face, well, I guess I can't let that slide. But you better take back the last part. When did I ever come after you? Uh... Huh? Said you wouldn't get mad! Crap. There's no way I can leave her alone when she's acting like this. S sorry, I, I'm sorry I late yelled at you. Please don't cry anymore. <laughs> hey, and then, if you're really sorry, can you buy me the thing I like? Huh? What the heck? Fine. What do I have to buy you? It's shaped like a star, and it's small, and it's cute, and it's sweet. She's probably talking about a crumpets, candy, confetto. Dude, I don't know this. I, I want to get it right. Um, crap. What do I do here? I don't know. Uh, this is hard. This is hard. Is it candy? It's shaped like a uh candy, candy, candy. So you just want candy, right? I wonder if I saw any star-shaped ones. Wrong. It's not something that boring. It's smaller and cuter than normal candy. Jeez, what the hell? She's probably talking about... Uh, con confetto? Um, do you mean, uh, confetto? Yoko nodded silently. You, at least she stopped crying. Then, do you want me to go buy it right now? Jeez! Just so you know, you won't find that in, in the supermarket. Oh, uh, really? Yes! Jeez, yes. Hajime, you're such a pushover. You totally promised me without realizing it was impossible. You even got tricked by, by, me fa by my fake crying. Oh, you definitely weren't faking those tears. <laughs> Jeez, you're so hopeless. I guess I'll go easy on you and make you bring me something else. Let's see. Go steal Sonia's panties for me. Are you trying to make me a criminal? Bitch, bring me Gundam's earrings then. For earring then. <laughs> and you better steal it. I don't want you to borrow it. You don't really want it, do you? Uh, you're just trying to make me suffer. Just let me bring you a different snack. I'll get you something you like. Why? But they don't have anything cute there. I gotta have something like uh, flower candies made with refined Japanese sugar. You spoiled little brat. Uh, there's no way you can get those kind of traditional candies here. But just as I thought, you really, uh, just as I thought, you really do like traditional Japanese candies, huh? Hey. Well, it's so elaborately made that it's practically art. They're so small and sparkly and cute. I love them so much. <laughs> Foreign sweets are made with too much sugar, so they're perfect for uncultured idiots. If she hadn't said that last part, I would have been impressed. Well, this is Hyoko after all. I guess I just have to accept it. But I do feel like I understand Hyoko a little more now. Hyoko's report card has been updated based on your experience, prefer. Okay, yeah. Hyoko asked me to do the impossible to do impossible things for her all day. By the time I returned to my college, I was wiped out. Okay, cool. Let me check my report card. It's still bright out, and I still got some time left. Let me go to my report cards and go to Hyoko. So I have one star for everyone, and then I have two stars for Hyoko. Okay. Uh, okay. No, turn on auto. Turn off auto. I don't feel like doing anything, so maybe I should go somewhere. Still free time. Let me go to Hyoko again. This is what I was doing for freaking um. Celeste. But I was speedrunning Celeste because I was already far and I was doing uh freaking what's her face again? I forgot her name. Kyoko, there you go, Kyoko. Uh, I was doing hers and then I moved over to uh to uh, Celeste after I finished Kyoko's. Hold up, give me one second guys. Okay, so I got a phone call. <laughs> a random number, I don't know. <laughs> I, I always have to answer my phone calls now because of work. So every single phone call I get, I have to answer it because I don't know, I don't have everyone at work's phone number. I only have um, one of the bosses and there's many managers. So I only have one of them. And um, I just have the main store phone number saved. And then I also have the phone number saved of somebody who got fired, I think. I don't know, it was, it was one of the previous bosses. Either she quit or she got fired. But 
I still have that phone number. I gotta get rid of that one. She doesn't work where I work anymore. Okay. Um, I, I'll just use the map to find Yoko. It's easier. Um, map. And let's go find Hiyoko. Because she's nowhere there. Escape. Let's see. Is Hiyoko anywhere here? Hiyoko's over here. Okay. Uh, let's go see Hiyoko. Yo, Hiyoko. What's she doing all back over here? Yes! <laughs> Hajime, yes. you're totally a loser. Don't you think? Your face and clothes are so boring. <laughs> Maybe no one would even notice if you disappeared. What should I do? Should I hang out with Hiyoko? <laughs> when she's acting like this? I like Hiyoko to hang out. Why no, not? No. What? No way! Hanging out with you will definitely be boring! If you really insist, I'll play on my own. Just don't get in my way. I spent time today with a next to Hyoko, desperately trying not to get in her way. <laughs> it looks like Hyoko and I grew a little closer. Or did we? I'll I'll give her. I'll give her a, a gift. I don't have anything cool. I have a I have Ramune. Hold up, there's two things up here. Ramune and uh oh that's just uh I have none. Okay. <laughs> so let's see, let's see, let's see. What's uh what do I have down here? This one was the the dolls. I'll just give her Ramune. <laughs> Why not? I don't know where the Ma Amano Yashin is, so I can't really do that. What? I can only get what I can get from here. Huh? This present is for me? <laughs> oh, I thought it was a piece of trash. Oh well, I guess I'll take it. Yeah. Yay! This island has lots of flowers! I love flowers. Well, I guess this place looks pretty scenic. But I'm surprised that someone like you likes flowers and stuff. Aww. What does that mean, you stupid ugly idiot? You're so mean! How can you perform a traditional Japanese dance if you don't have that- You don't have those cherished flowers? You don't understand at all, do you? Alright, oh, despite her, her looks, I totally forgot that she's the ultimate traditional da dancer. If she didn't have her foul mouth and run attitude, she'd look perfect standing next to flowers. Hey, hey! I love flowers because they're so pretty. I used to play at flower gardens when I was a kid. <laughs> it was a lot of fun stomping them and messing them up. <sighs> Wait, didn't you just say that she loved flowers because they're so pretty? Understand? It's fun to stomp pretty things with my feet and kick them all over the place. How can you like that? Oh yeah, Akane saw me the other day when I was stomping flowers too. She asked me what I was doing, but it was so annoying to explain it to her. So I told her that stomping and kicking your food before you eat it gives you a lot more protein. <laughs> what? Then she actually started eating the flowers. But she, uh, but she said they didn't taste that good. Um, okay. <laughs> I mean, I can imagine Akane doing that. But it doesn't change the fact that this kid is a rotten jerk. He's seriously so stupid. Hmm. What should I make her do the next time I see her? Then again, Akane is gullible, so no matter what I tell her to do, it'll be it'll, it'll be too boring. It's a lot more fun to just to mess with the Mikan. Hey, uh, Hyoko. Hmm, what? You must not have very many friends. What? Well, no duh. What's wrong with that? Friends are what you call a bunch of weaklings who decide to get along and play nice, right? Hey, hey! The world is filled with people who exist to serve perfect humans like me. That, that's why I don't need friends or any close contacts. You're just my slave, got it? S slave no. Hey, that's no big- that's a big no-no. A slave should never talk back to their master. You don't really understand, but... Hyoko is giving me detailed instructions on how slaves should behave. Hyoko's report card has been updated based on her experience with her. Yep, okay. He felt physically and mentally exhausted, so I went back to my cottage. Okay. Oh, we're back in my cottage. It's now nighttime. Dang, 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 okay. It's Monoku. The Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. Hello, everyone. The fun time you've all been waiting for is about to begin! Oh. I wonder what festivities await you! Oops, don't want to ruin the surprise! It was a little meh at first, but anyway, please gather at Jabberwock Park! Did he just tell us to go to the park? Isn't it? It's the middle of the night, what's he up to? I suddenly had a bad feeling about all of this, and goosebumps sprung up all over my body. If we're not allowed to defy Monokuma, then there's no way I can ignore this, right? Which means there's nothing I can do except listen to it. Damn it! What is it now? Let me uh, save the game real quick. 
a system. Save. Save it there. Save. Yep. Okay. Uh, let me come over to my OBS. But I'm going to end uh, today's Danganronpa video here. It's, um... You know, it's, uh, I feel like something might happen next video, but I have no idea. There's only one way we can find out. The next video is probably not going to be in until another month. Because of how long it's not freaking taken to make the Danganronpa videos. I'm playing so many games at the same time right now. I don't know why I do this. I just got to finish one. Uh, that's why I was trying to focus on Persona, but then other games, uh, I started playing those too. But yeah, Corpse Party, I got to finish that one, which I have like two more chapters left, I think two or three i think it's three and also what else what else what else we got other other games um honkai star rail it's gonna take forever to finish that one because it's definitely of course not finished yet but it's gonna take forever to catch up because i uh playing the game is you no know, i don't know but either way guys i hope you enjoyed today's uh about danganronpa <laughs> danganronpa 2 a uh, goodbye despair video and I but, uh, make sure to subscribe. And of course, I will see you all in the next one. Peace out and bye bye.